I'm delighted and honoured to present the Coach of the Year to a real inspiration to me, Smithy. Um, this means the world to me. Uh, firstly, uh, I want to thank Fabio, Fabla. Um, <laughs> it's been a pleasure taking you under my wing, and uh, you mean the world to me. Gianni Lore, lo inspirate, ti amo. I want to thank my mum and Rudy and. Uh, Pamela, Mick, Gavla, of course. Um, mostly, I want to thank my boy, Neil. Um, everything I do is to, is to make you proud. And um, actually, I'm um, sorry, I, I, uh, I can't accept this. What is this? This is all wrong. This isn't sport. This is showbiz. You lot sitting here in your dicky bows and your trendy frocks, you don't care about winning. You only care about, about awards and titles. I mean, Sir Steve Redgrave. Sir Steve, come on, mate. What do you need a knighthood for? You row around in a little boat. Me and my nephew did that at the weekend. I mean, Dame Kelly Holmes. Kelly, you've got two gold medals, but essentially your job is just running around. <laughs> running around in circles. You don't need a Dame Hub. You're not Judy Dench. I mean, there's a proper runner, right? Paula Radcliffe. You, you do 800 meters. She does 26 miles occasionally. <laughs> you don't see her demanding titles and awards. There is a true sporting legend and I tell you it's great to see you Paula you being looked after if people showed you where the toilets and stuff are not that you <laughs> need them really go where you like eh Giggsy Giggsy great to see you my man still hanging in there still going strong what are you now 46 47 it's going great it's going great I tell you what how you were never picked for England I don't know right it's a disgrace Freddie Freddie, 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 Freddie. Freddie, Freddie Flintoff. What's your real name? Andrew. Whatever. <laughs> you know what? Congratulations on the Ashes. You did brilliant. It was great. It was great to see you out there. But you're going to give up now? You're going to stop playing because your knee hurts? <laughs> Is it sore? Is it a bit poorly? Yeah? A bit of poorly knee. I tell you what, your arm's all right though, isn't it? In fact, in fact, your knee your knee looked pretty good when you were shooting that deodorant commercial last year. But bang, cha-ching! But bang, cha-ching! You are a disgrace! You never give up on your country. You let your country give up on you, all right? Talk to Steve McLaren, Graham Taylor. You're a joke. Pendleton. Mm -mm, you was looking fine, gal. Do you know what? You got it. You've got it, and I don't even know what it is, but you got it, yeah? <laughs> and any time you just want to get together, hang out, talk about, I don't know, tyres or gears, <laughs> Balance Armstrong, yeah? <laughs> you just let me know, yeah? You got my digits, you hook me up, okay? <laughs> nice, good things. Amir, Amir Khan, you're at the top of your game. You are doing great, my son. Good for you. I tell you what I think you need, what I think you need right now at this point in your career is a catchphrase. I'm talking, <laughs> you know what I mean, Harry? <laughs> you know what I mean, Harry? Seriously, Frank, 
Frank, how many pantos you get off the back of that? 12? 13? <laughs> Honestly, Amir, you play your cards right, you get a catchphrase. This time next year, you could be on Strictly. Yeah? <laughs> oh, and look who it is. Look who it is. Sebastian Coe. <laughs> Seb Coe. Lord Coe. I bet you're pleased with yourself, Encha. It's all going well, yeah? You've got your, got your Olympics, you've got your little 2012, it's all worked out, yeah? Feeling pleased with yourself, yeah? The traffic getting out of Essex is already a nightmare. <laughs> Look at you, sat there in your suit, his lordship. I remember when you was just a runner mugging off Steve Ovet. <laughs> now you're just, you're just like the rest of this lot. All of you, you've, you've lost your way. It's become muddled somehow. You've, you've forgotten what's important. I don't see a room full of sporting legends here. I see a room full of people looking for their next sponsorship deal, book deal, TV series. You wouldn't see W.T. Grace demean himself on Ready Steady Cook. <laughs> Roger Bannister wouldn't have had a Twitter page. <laughs> Fred Perry, Bobby Moore, Duncan Goodhue, these are true sporting legends. You lot. You need to get back to basics. Remember who you are, what you are, what you stand for. Can we win the World Cup? Yes, we can. Can we win at Wimbledon? Yes, we can. Can we win at the Olympics? And I'm talking proper medals, not just swimming and cycling, ones that actually count, basically running. Yes, we can. Can we do this, people of Britain? Can we? Can we do this, Jensen Button? Yes, we can. Can we do this, David Hay? Yes, we can. Can we do this, Chris Akamusi? Yes, we can. Yeah. Don't believe in your agents. Don't believe in your managers. Don't believe in your publicists. Believe in yourselves because we, we believe in you. And together, if we unite, we can make Britain great once more! Thank you! Thank you.